Next we have Simon, a very nice amateur wrestler starting off in school. Then we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles' very own brother, Raphael. As the match begins, literally look at Raphael coming into this match with so much charisma. Literally him and the Ninja Turtle all overpowering him, knocking him into the corner. Simon was already warming up and Raphael just leaning in the corner, just relaxing. Oh, hoo -hoo. explosive. <laughs> explosive already. Raphael of the Ninja Turtles. Amazing. The only Ninja Turtle to make it into my business with massive headbutts. Really basking in the glory of the fans, but we all know that's going to be a turn into a different match when he gets angry. But as of late, he seems to be doing pretty well. Will he advance or will Simon figure out a way? Simon does figure out ways in a match to turn it into his favor. Like right there. That's a classic move. He's into the classic moves. Russian leg sweep, wrestling takedowns. Old-fashioned submissions. Like back in the day, like WWF or Triple WF. He's not really too keen on the a whole super kicks and stuff like that. Trained ever since school, all reversed. And always before he goes into a match, he's always seeking out his opponent, always watching their old matches. Very strategic superstar. But don't get him wrong, he is a hard hitter in the ring. He can work some magic. We call him the star athlete, which is why you see all the stars on his outfit. <laughs> Count of seven, imagine. Imagine there is no winner to this match. They both just, just don't win. Oh, can I eat? Out of nine, Raphael, cool, calm, and collected by Simon. Put him up to the top rope. The silence. Up on his shoulders. Classic gut buster. What a nasty kick to the chest. The shell chest of Raphael. Oh, sling blade. Basement drop kick. Super fast. Super agile. Did you see how fast he kicked up and instantly went for that sling blade drop kick combination? Fans are on their feet right now. Raphael is in love. Did you see that? With the aggression. The flips. I actually never seen that in the game before until now. Can he be going for the signature? No, he will not. Whew, that uppercut. Simon with a reversal. Reversing. What, another one? Oh my, what was that? He went inside, outside, on the apron, then back in the inside with the drop kick. That was a major, that was not a major clip, but it was a glitch. But a nasty back elbow. Getting up from that one instantly. But a fisherman suplex. Wasted no time going for that pin. Will he be going for the shell shot? Oh, missed the double axe handle.
Oh, what is he doing? Oh, ho, ho, he's going for oh my god moment. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. Torpedo. DDT made famous by Sami Zayn, done by Raphael here tonight. Put it, taking out all the stops. This is awesome chance. Roaring what? Oh, it, what? What? Okay. I'm not complaining, but what was that? Into the steps. I don't like when they get stuck over here. And a four, Simon has a signature, so it does Raphael. Arm ringer, leg drop. Targeting the arm. Oh, German suplex. Nasty German suplex. That was his signature. Got him eight. Got a nine. Rafael. Okay. Reversing. Belly to belly. If I'm calling things out before you see it, it's because, like, the game is going faster than the recording, or the recording is going slower. So, yeah, like, most of the things you already saw happened already. Like, he's done taunting. Like, two seconds behind. Judo throw... Oh, Judgment Slam! Judging the wrestling style of Raphael. As he goes for the pan, could it be it? Russ Simon advances in the tournament. Hard fought battle between these two. That first single leg, that, that sling blade and basement drop kick combination was. Absolutely just incredible. That fisherman suplex. That torpedo DDT. The German suplex that his literally his head hit the apron. Of course the winning pin, but we don't want to see that. <laughs> 